Okay, so first thing you want to do is make sure you're logged into Google uh, as well as into Google Chrome. So it, in order to know that, you can see here I'm on Google, I'm logged in. It shows my name. It might show your email address instead of your name. Also, I know I'm logged into Chrome because this tab up here has my name. If it has the silhouette of a person, you're not logged into Chrome. Click that silhouette and then you'll log in with the exact same username and password that you use to log into Google and that will log you into Chrome. Once you've done that, then you can go to apps and click that. And then you will see a screen similar to this, but you're going to click on this very first button, which is the web store and click that. This is like the app store for your phone, um, but it's extensions and apps for Google Chrome. And one of the things you want to download is an extension uh, for converting docs, uh, documents into a Google Drive uh, format. So I need to remember the name of it, and I'm going to look here. Uh, there we go. So uh, you want to type in Office Editing for Docs. And you will see here extensions. And you can see here Office Editing for Docs, Sheets, and Slides. And you can see that I've added it. Yours will say Add to Chrome. And you'll click that blue button. And it'll ask you a couple of questions. And you'll say yes to all of them. And it will install uh, this extension into your menu up here. And you can see I've got a ton of extensions installed. And one of them uh, is the Office Editing for Docs. And I'm going to go ahead and turn that on so I can show you how it works. So now that I've installed that extension, now you have the ability to convert any file from your computer, from your P drive, from your desktop, into your Google Drive. So if you're using your school Google account, uh, you can drag and drop files into Chrome, and it'll automatically save them to your drive. So uh, let's, I'll show you how that works. So I just open a new tab just so it's easier to see. With this extension, I can now, I can minimize this, and I can now take any Word document from anywhere on my computer and get it into Google Drive. Why do you want to do this? Because when you're sitting at home on an e-learning day, you want to have access to all your documents. And if you don't have them on a Google Drive, you don't have access to them because they're on your computer or on your P drive here at school. And so you want to have access to everything that you've ever created, basically, uh, that you might want to use for e-learning. So I'm going to find a file here. Um, and uh, here it's a pro professional conference request. It's a Word document. Now with this extension, I can just drag it and drop it anywhere into this Chrome window. And now that I've done that, it's going to convert it. And so it's taken this Word document and it's put it into, it's put it into Google Drive. And so now that it's in Google Drive, now I can convert it, save as a Google Doc. Click that. It's going to convert the Word document to a Google Doc. And now it is in my drive as a Google document. At that point, then I can get to it anywhere. So when I'm at home on an e-learning day, it's there because it's on the internet and I have internet. Uh, so that's the easiest way to go about moving your, your files from a P drive into Google Drive so that you have access on an e-learning day. I uh, hope that helps and email me if you need more assistance.